Stephen Bid, how have you managed to get to Katonga in the first place? Priscilla, the reason as to why I'm here in just less than uh, one hour is just because it's almost a lockdown here from PG to this particular place of Katonga. Uh, there is absolutely no congestion. I've counted only three taxis, and those taxis were just coming from Buwama and others from Nabusanke towards uh, the side of Mpiji. The, but the rest of the road is so clear. Before we turn to this particular place where nature, I'm told, is fighting for its own space, let me uh, let Brian Kayondo, who is here on camera, turn towards the road coming from Nabusanke and Kayawe to show you how this is almost what you could call a lockdown, this other southern part of Uganda, as you drive from Piji, Kampala, and Fiji, and towards this side. It's almost, I think, uh, 71 kilometers from Kampala as you, as you come toward this place. But you can see clearly it's only the NTV car and the, the vehicle for the chairperson of uh, Piji district, Piji district, who is here with me, Martin Sejengo, Martin Sejemba, who is going to let me know as local leaders here in Piji. Uh, local government authorities, what are they doing? How have we reached this particular place uh, when uh, the Katonga is no longer passable? Uh, I grew up uh, going using this road, but now at least I can confirm to you that the water levels that were on the road and now are uh, have now gone into the riverside, but at least you can see the road is completely cut off. There are also some other marks that could indicate that maybe any time from now, this other side here could also sink, sink in or sunk in as uh, we saw yesterday. Let me first of all speak to the chairperson of uh, PG district, that is Martin Sejemba. Uh, as local leaders, uh, we can see this. We never used to have uh, water levels to this particular, uh, what, what we're seeing now. This side, already electric poles are also down. Martin Sejemba, you are the chairperson of PG district. As local leaders, uh, where have you been when uh, all this is happening? I thought you could have uh, some warning bells to the community. Good morning, good morning viewers, good morning NTV. I'm Sergei Mba Martin, the district chairperson. I think it is a tragedy. Now this is a contribution. It is history made. Over the history of the years of existence of this river, I think we've not gotten such an incidence. And I think it is one of the effects we are now observing the hard eating effects right now that the business, you could see that business alongside Massacre Road has come to a standstill. People cannot cross. I've had some of my citizens who are living just cross over here. They were for barrier just within a minute. They were caught to the other side and they slept over just when their homes are here. Mm -hmm. I think this is, this is a very hard lesson for us to learn who are contributing to the bad history. History, there is good history and there is bad history. We have seen so many people who have our, our elders who have contributed to the good history. And now what we are seeing here is a contribution to the bad history that we are experiencing right now. And uh, I think this is attributed so much to the high levels of encroachment on environment and the need, the urge of people who have power to possession in natural natural facilities and natural, uh, natural things like uh, swamps and all of that. I think these are very, very hard questions. And there are so, it has risen so many questions mm. to us and the preparedness of us as local government mm. to counteract. First of all, we've all seen some of these issues. We've been crying on the levels of encroachment and the untouchables who encroach heavily on the environment. And the poor funding that is given to us as local government to work on the swamp areas, the drainage system that feeds into the catchment of this one. Because this is indicating that there has been huge blockages somewhere and the diversions and the water flows are not spread out to the natural to the natural facilities of forests and, uh, and swamps. Contributing to that as local government, the preparedness of us to counteract this, I think it is lack of capacity, but again, we are sitting, we have sat, we sat at a meeting overnight to see how we could also contribute, how we could develop a simple emergency work plan to work on the swamp areas around the catchment to manage the pressures in the mainstream of River Katonga to control the flows. 
But I tell you, after developing that, we are looking forward to seeing the quick intervention of the Ministry of uh, Prime Minister's Office, uh, the Ministry of Works, and UNULA to come on this major thing and also to listen to us as local leaders. As they listen to you, uh, Mr. Martin Sejimba, the yes. district chairperson of PG, I also have to inform you that uh, director from UNRWA, that is for roads and bridges, uh, Samuel Mohoz, is also on the way, and now uh, within a short time he'll be reaching this particular place. I also want to understand the emergency uh, measures that you, when you sat yesterday, that you, uh, those measures you, you came up with. But before that, I want also to, uh, Brian, to zoom in. There are some vehicles that are still stuck that side of uh, Buganga, coming from Kayunga, that's Kayunga Buganga, along with the Masakalo. There, some of them, as the chairman says, some of them spend the night there. Some of them have longer vehicles. They cannot cross, and they cannot even, some of them cannot even turn back. But I wonder how this police officer is able to stand just, a, just almost at the turn of the bridge here at Katonga. But also, let me get back to you, Mr. Chairman. Those, when you sat yesterday, what are some of those inter, inter, immediate measures that you put, place, put in place as wait for UNRWA, as wait for Minister of Transport, for OPM, what, have you what are you going to be doing as the local government? Because this is your area. Yes, first of all, we instructed the Disaster Preparedness Committee that is at the district level and the engineer to develop an emergency work plan to work on the swampy areas that are serving within the catchment of Katonga to reduce on the stress of the waters mm -hmm. so that it can be provided to the Minister of Works and the Minister of Pri uh, the Prime Minister's Office for support intervention with the excavators to help us clean the drainage systems within around the sub counties that are around and the swampy areas because most of the roads that we do maintain as a district, we don't have excavators. We just pump in the, the, the malam and then, and then grade. We have graders and, and, uh, and compactors. We don't have excavators to clean. And I think it is also confused. As an emergency, we sat and we developed a work plan. We tasked them to develop a work plan immediately as a quick intervention so that we can attract some more support so that we can clean up the drainage within the swamps that are around so that the stress of the flow can be accommodated within other swamps around mm. so that the water stress mm. that is exerted on Katonga Bridge here could reduce. That is one of the interventions. And also, also it's a wake-up call. It's a wake-up call that the encroachers that are practicing within the environmental mm. sensitive areas, they could be evacuated immediately and we are questioning, we are questioning, we have also sat and we've realized that the power centers, everyone who has some powers, wants to own some land within the swamp. And in fact, on that particular, particular issue, I'm told there are some political leaders, some business leaders, some religious leaders who have uh, sand mines, mine, mining uh, areas in the, within the swamp area, but also some are also growing rice. How is this happening? And are you watch as the le local leaders? No, it's not under our watch. We've, we've almost encountered so many of them. We've chased them, and they have persisted to be operating legally with permits from, from, from NEMA, allowing them to work and do activities within the swamps. I think the challenge is not, because even the enforcement at local levels, we've met a challenge implementing directives on the local small practitioners within the swamps when the big people are still operating they are being guarded and they have the permits to work in these sensitive areas so now the problem is to the central government to ask the responsible people who have who are sitting in responsible positions who are having power and responsibilities of implementing and enforcing we should we should desert the behavior of wanting to own plots and personalizing swamps and forestry areas, these sensitive ecological areas for protection. The country is here to stay. We are here to stay. We are leaders on a contract of five years. Mm. We shall ask mandate, mm. but we are questioning okay. the political will okay. and the behavior, mindset mm. of people with the power. Mm. They should drop the behavior of wanting to own these natural sensitive areas because they are now hitting hard on us we don't know when and we don't know the rains are still coming mm. the diverse effects i think they are simply beyond but it must be a deliberate mm. a deliberate move for us to give in and also have a control
Okay, thank you so much, uh, Mr. Martin Sejemba, the chairperson of um, PG District. Uh, Kansoke ngasina kudia kugamechi kugamechi kusemba yo. Njalo kula bayo omu kubantu Ben Sanzu wano. Sima nyi chiche bakola. Sima nyi wachibu wali wano. Atena wachibu wakili ziduwa kubela wano. Uh, mkulu. Mstaba oje ombulile. Uh, gwe wa mchitu undu chino. Uh, ugambo tia. Yetulise. Mm, ya kukuatila. Yetulise. Wali mm. wajase. Betuli. Hey. Wano ukula wochi. Nze ni neiba wa wano. Mm. Tuli katongu. Mwe senza muntoba zi. Aa. Mm. Fetuli wao kusaidi ya mwebesa. Tuina one chapa. Chino chiba kose za chitia? Tine ntambule eno jina baza deba angevali masaka. Mm. Ya tuina one vivanja. Tachichizibu ato genda. Mm. Uluwa ulugudo kukutuka. Mm. E. Lewa nuhu yu midi detoyi na wela likifunti ya maza kukula wa manji nyo. E. Ate unolugudo wa, 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 wa bomo semu. E. Usu, sawi nyo solo kukwamu. Ya sina wela likilifu kubanga. Uluwa mm. ulutindo wa zeba luongira konga wetuli. Then na kula kwenye movie umabia masanya zegano, ngaba tambuzi ya masanya zegana amapia, ah gana amaneni. Kaka sina wera liki kwenye nsonga. Na yenge era wera liki ni nango limu chiduko kusomoka wano. E kuwango inzo gende raku. E kato lugu dolu no feche tula banga ba tuzeba wano. Ba lusera chine chitulu ya chingiza amaza gachifulumia. Chari cheta gatilisti. E, bituli bisatu ebiga fulumia okay. e, nega sobola okutambula kubanga okay. olunaku lwegajja ga blockinga ebintu ebisangidwa oga bikutula ne gabanga gabiyisawo wano gama ne gali nya level side ne side okay. e webale nyo enyo gambyani nze mukasavice webale nyo mukasavice sent a kanjogere ko no mutundo za nasemba yo na ye ali mu kitundu kino Wano tuli katonga uh, kulugudo lwe masaka nsi kutegeze zanti kati ene balinga baze damuloko down uh, wa mugalo kubanga ebiduka okuya dale mpiji ku bikondo okutukya dale ne katonga mbaze o taxi satu zo kati nazo zitambulira wakati kati uh, kubanga tewali nyo bantu era business za bantu anji nyo za kosedwa ema waguleri wali wo chi truck oba chi motoka ate cha de chi geza kuisha wo cho cha soda ate ro kugwamu wa kufa kulugudo ntegeze dwa konti ne mulwera amazi gasaze kanjogere kati no mukuru ndo ya nasemba yo uh, tubulire ye wano eno uh, uh, kola wo chi uh, vunanyizwa kuchi era ye chigena maso uh, chirabate chi mukosa za chi oh, nze muanje alex andrew nganze deputy speaker wa mpg atela nganze councilor chi kira ka we town council ne wano wetuli nganza atwalao mu luchiko wa district ya mpg yetu watu seko chino te chiberangawo kya bulabe nyo eri abantu bafe abantu bali mu mbeera nzibuddala ebacha asobola kusala okuva mu kayawe okuva Kampala okudda mu bitundu bya Masaka kudda mu bitundu ebiliranyeewo ngalukaya ebacha asobola abantu bafe banji bakonko malide ku makubo tebaina kya kulya muri muna abakolira mu kitundu kyange kya kayawe ngabava mu buganga wano bava mu bitundu wano nge bya nebye wanga ninga kakati abana bali eri ngabazadde bali ene kitegeza anti tebaina na kya kulya abantu bafe mbeera mbiddala kitusaba government a uh, eroze kati ne yunura eroze kokolo olutindo olu luno ngaluga zibu lunji ngalusitufu sobolo kubera kati tudamu kufuna kizibu kifana ko bwechit obo lyao no kuloza ku nkole ya flyovers mm. okulaba ngati tudamu kufuna mbera efana gana ko ngene mwanja alex andrews speaker deputy speaker mpg district webale nyo a uh, chigame chisemba ya sentebe wa district mpg kubanga ono tuli yensalo salo yensalo dala ya ula mpg uh, ku masaka kubanga oluva okusala ano kuderi atetu watu ingide uh, lwela neruka ya abalimu district ya masaka uh, bana bana mpg uh, bana maokota bako basa nyala zedua mumbela za weze obu ntu uh, mwakago wa basula mu business za abwe abamu pise kulugudo luna luna nga ama, maduka gamu gacha ina magali entambula ya basa nyala de ulugudo tulu teli entambula luno chiche chino kubanga chikole wa mkasera nga kano nga watu nga watu nzika programu eno uh, chino kubanga chikole wa sawe no okubanga tufuna reso nize zenja uloze tuigamu mchi obutonde chemiso ulo kubela nga butu kola ko nechi uli omuje chiteke do kubela nga chimuku watako Okula bikanti no nebo boko la chitono chitia. Omuti gosi gaza o no muntu gobuli de obuzibu obuto de buteke dokola chikuru nyo. Neu kakati muemaji nse kakati tusubiro kubera anti no pressure zikende demuko overflow zuwe deo. Ida tulinze waneno aba, aba, aba yunura 
okujja okula bikanga tukubento tengeje tugenda okufixinga mu wano business is demo okutambula kuba billions of money ze tuluzinze ne district yange firizidwa omusolo munji nyo kugatta na abantu business ezifudde nnyingi nyo ne bintu ebadde bakozesa ebyamanyi so kakade yo kyensubira okula bikanno kitekedwa abantu okwerinda okola ate no kumanya no kumanya ntino kakati government etekedwa okumanya nti abantu abetolode kitundu kinene ekikuwa tagana ne ngudo za feze tolode wano ne swamp seziriwo okubera nti no tuwe bwana fe ku byuma ne sent okulai kan solo growinga drains ne meku brokinga kuwanga effects zinene kati baba kitusiza ku gwanga singa mpije bade ya webwa obuwumbi nga butano bwe yetaga okusoko okugugula emyala ne ntoba zizinene wesa kachu richayu ade ne kati billions of money egwanga lifiridwa obuwumbi no buwumbi bwa sente billions of money ezifude misoro ne kifana gana ko bwechi chovola bantino eyo tuchiraba chigwani do kulabi kantino tubera ne consideration zezo ne tusobola kuete kateka na fine tubera rede okulabi kantino atene ensonga dalala dalala semba ye kwatagana no butonde tukubira omulanga abantu abali mu office ezibwe na mwe na fe na fe nabali mu office tulekerawo okwagala okufuna ebyobwerere ebyalekebwawo bajjajja fe na abantu bonna muntu obazine ebibira okwagala okubifura ebyo bwananyinyi bigenda kubera anti no bitulete lobuzivu era bigenda kubera bikusanyiza au nawe obera anti no ogezeza ako either ngo funa mu sente abamu babikofani abafuna mu sente abalala babikoze sate bobe nyinyi nyinyi okubereka nga baberawo ne kino kizibu nnyo naye abantu banampiji bakubiriza okufaya nyo ku butonde ate tubere bakakkamu okulabika anti no tusobola okuwagira obutonde okuyimirirawo ate ne gwanga lyonna tusobole okuzukuka wake up Uganda wake up mpiji Wepale nyo, thank you so much, uh, Martin Sejemba, he's the chairperson of um, PG District. I should tell you that also, Stephen Imbidon Fefeso Echivuga, I also have my maternal uh, ancestral grounds here. Just a stone throw from this particular place, that is in Boganga, Kayunga, uh, that is just along this massacre road. Aida, nsaside nyo, obukoja wangewo na, abali yao, enabie wanga, Boganga, Golo, nao, uh, we kayunga uh, kubanga ukojja we buli era mbasasi kubanga badde basala gudolu no kubanga badde kamba but i know that uh, government has already uh, made it clear that there is people can use the alternative route through chinoni gomba and connect to mpiji directly but for now this is the situation here in katonga at the katonga river as we update you on what's happening and as we wait for unra uganda national roads authority directors who are going to be here to work with the local authorities here to see how they can quickly fix it, uh, the situation here. But at least you know that also the, pot, the, the poles for electricity are also down. I have to hand you back to studio for Masuze Mutia at 9 a.m. But for now, thank you so much for being a part of Morning at NTV. Steven Imbidon, Fefe Suechibuga, Elvis Sennon on sports, uh, Chris Higeni and Priscilla Regina Naroga. We say thank you and we wish you a nice weekend.